Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Juju the Gamer here, and I'm bringing you guys something I've never played before. This is Psychopath's Mandatory Happiness. Um, I don't, I don't even know what this game is about. All I know is it's in the Psychopath anime universe, and I loved both season of Psychopath. I personally thought season one was better. I thought season two could have been more than eleven episodes, but that's a whole different discussion. Let's get into it. Oh, wait, wait. Fuck. Shinkini game of Kaishi Shimas. Okay, um Game no Kakshu Setteo Game Is is there like Okay, I was trying to find game of Kaisa Shimas. Well let's just would I like to skip the prologue? Sure. Monogatari no Shujin Kowo Sentakushi Kudasai. Oh wait, no. My fault. My fault. I had no idea I was gonna do that. Are there like voices in this game or is it just I have to read everything? Okay. I might just have to read everything. So Sado Marine City National Hospital. Far above the man made dome of the once renowned Metro Paradise stood an ivory tower, and within this tower lie part of the city's core functions. And deep within it Oh what 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 He infiltrated the tower's core with ease. <laughs> Could it have been any easier? The network firewall is paper thin. This security system door opened easier than a child's room. He whispered to himself. He had avoided social interactions for so long, now he only spoke to himself. It should be somewhere in this tower. My new toy. Where have they hidden it? He searched. And searched. For his toy, which had to be somewhere. Oh, no, this translation might be off. Found it. Oh. Uh, okay. Uh. Uh, was not expecting this. There it was. His toy in a neurosurgery room as written on a hospital map. It was his first time touching it, but with only a glance, he knew. So is this like a, like a cyborg android? What, what is going on here? これは僕のために作られた人形だ。こんなところに閉まい込んでおいちゃかわいそうだ。さあ、行こう。僕と一緒に。A doll? This doll was made for me. It would be a waste to lock it away in such a place. Come along with me. From now on, you shall move as my body. Let us depart. I have a mission to fulfill. A very important one for mother. So, if I'm making assumptions about this, a system hacked into this network to find this body to take over. And y'all see why I'm making such tech, tech, technological advances to doom us all. 
I'll try to kill everybody. To bring happiness to everyone, that is my mission. But everyone has differing degrees of what their happiness is. How are you going to do that, fam? Isn't that right, mother? Mm, who should I pick? Uh, let's go with you. Why had things turned out like this? Where in the fuck is he located? Damn it! Let me out! Let me out of here! I have to... I have to... Why? <laughs> what did I go wrong? Such a futile question. I have been born and raised in a rural city far away from Tokyo. Oh. So... Like... See, when they say far away from Tokyo, what prefecture are they talking about? There's a lot of rural areas in Japan. The civil, the civil system judge humans, leading them to the path that maximizes their future happiness. Education, marriage, employment, everything. Yeah, yeah, the civil system judge people's mental spaces. And if you're in the red, <laughs> You gone, fam. <laughs> you out of here. <laughs> the judgment that had been given to me was to live and die in that rural city. That was fine. It's not like I didn't like it there, but I did regret obeying Sybil. Yeah, <laughs> I'm pretty... Would it have been better to go against Sybil's judgment and seek employment in Tokyo after all? I'm pretty sure had you disobeyed the Sybil system, you'd probably still end up here, wherever you're located. <laughs> I knew it wasn't possible, but I can help but think about it. The world now was a place where one couldn't get a job unless Sybil deemed them suitable. Yeah... Yeah, yeah, in, in this anime, unless, well, in this universe, rather, if you were, like, orange or red, like, if you had orange or red as your color, you, you, you couldn't do nothing, fam. You had to stay in the green. Even if I went against and it came to Tokyo, the only thing I could have expected to happen was to fail finding a job and then becoming homeless. Then again, there was my childhood friend. Yukari Himikawa. Unlike me, she had the aptitude to study medicine in Tokyo. Such different paths. But I loved her. Yukari, what are you up to right now? One day, Yukari just disappeared. It made no sense that she didn't contact her parents or me. So I came to Tokyo searching for her. But she was nowhere to be found. That's... That's not good at all. <laughs> the school she attended, the place she worked at, I looked everywhere, but nobody knew where she had gone. It was useless. Everyone just said the same thing as I did. One day, Yukari Himikawa just vanished out of thin air. No one just ever vanishes out of thin air, my dude. But she gone, fam. <laughs> a resignation letter to her employee. That was the last time anyone heard from her. She never handed in her work or popped up out of the blue. Whoa, okay. That, yeah. The last time they heard of her was from a, when she resigned from work? That is troubling. 
As I searched for her, I became reckless. It wasn't long before my hue cloud and my crime coefficient rose. As a result, I became a latent criminal. Like I said, this universe is all about maintaining a good mental health, a good mental stability. And according to him, when he lost his best friend, his he kind of lost it. Due to, I don't, due to maybe panicking or where she was, if she was okay or not. And his hue, which was probably green, which probably green eventually became, you know, red or orange. No, orange or red. And, you know, his ability to perform potential crime roles. And as a result, he's probably in prison. <laughs> I'm a fool. Such a damn fool. However, my chance of salvation appeared right before my eyes. Oh. <laughs> Takuma Sulugi, I'm Nobuchika Genosa from the MWPSB CID. You have the aptitude to become an enforcer. Interested to work as one? That was my ticket out of hell. I jumped at the chance and I've never looked back. Yes, he probably was in prison. He was locked up. Had to be. Kokuga. <laughs> So, the Public Safety Bureau, huh? This is where I work now? Man, I'm so touched. I've always wanted to be a police detective. Police detective? You mean enforcer? まあ、まあ。Well, they're more or less the same thing, aren't they, Inspector Genoza? Both arrest criminals, right? それも正しくは潜在犯だ。まったく。お前は何度言えばわかるんだ。Latent criminals, to be correct. Jeez, how many times does it take for you to understand? Hi, hi. Senzai Han wa Hanza yo jiko steiru inai ni kakawarazu. Hanzai kesu nga ite ijo no mono o sasu. Daro? Yeah, yeah, latent criminal refer to those above a certain crime coefficient, regardless of whether they have committed a crime or not. Correct? Karenawa. They possess the potential to cause harm to society. The goal of the CID is to apprehend and isolate them before that ever happens. Yeah, like how I used to be. But I was in a good mood, so I kept that thought to myself. Sure, I had dreamed of being a detective. <laughs> sure, I had dreamed of being a detective since I was a kid. But more importantly, if I was in the PSB, I knew I had a better chance of finding more about Yukali's whereabouts. And for that reason, I was in pretty high spirits. What are you grinning about? Hurry up and move. Hi, <laughs> hi. Alright, alright. Get adjusted to how this enforcer device works. Mental care is important, so be sure to get used to using the hue checker. It wasn't uncommon to find programs that could check your own hue, but the PSB's special model was quite unique. 
It's built into our wrist cops. Yeah, like I said, his hue was orange. It's not all fun and games. The fact that they issued such a device said a lot about the stress that came with being a, a detective. Mental care is a personal responsibility, so be diligent, Genosa said Stern. Then he gave me a detailed tutorial about the device. He was really helpful. I checked my hue again. It was way better than before. It was like the first rays of sunlight on a clear morning. Apparently, this color is called Nasturtium Orange. I really hope I just pronounced that word right. If not, I'm going <laughs> to just rock with it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Before it had the chance to worsen, detectives are required to take mental supplements. That's our duty, apparently, and any medication was paid for at the public's expense. So the tax dollars is going to taking mental hair, mental supplements. But then again, I shouldn't need that anytime soon. I hope so. Hmm. Oi, Oh, Sunomori. Hmm. Hey, Inspector Sunomori, where are you taking those two? As we walked down the corridor, Ginoza stopped the three ladies coming from the other direction. I thought the criminal investigation department was full of tough men, but right before me stood a variety of women. Gorgeous, cool, and cute. あ、銀座さん。公安局の近くに美味しいサンドイッチのお店があるそうなので、国塚さんたちとお昼に。See, see like I was saying. I'm sure she did not say all of this. Oh, Inspector Ginoza, it seems there's a new sandwich place near the PSB, so Miss Kunizuka and the rest of us are going to grab some lunch. I've been waiting, I've been wanting to eat there for a while, but it's not like we can leave the premises by ourselves, right? So we asked the counter if she'd go with us. Hey, Genosa, you cold blooded fail. It's true that enforcers must be escorted by an inspector when they leave the premises. However, Sunomori, don't let yourself get too familiar with the enforcers. <laughs> I happen to be leaving for lunch anyway, and having a meal with company tastes better than eating alone. Soka. Soka. No, I see. I didn't think there was any need for him to make such a bitter face. By the way, who's that man over there? Oh, um, he's the newly assigned enforcer. Tsurugi Takumada. Ojo-san-tachi, yoroshiku tanomuze. Takuma Tsurugi. Nice to meet you, ladies. Ara, ii otoko shanai? Atashi wa karanomori shion. Well, aren't you a fine looking man? I'm Shion. I'm Shion Kalanamo. Kalanano. Kalanomo. Okay. Now, excuse me. I'm Shion Kalanomori, the analyst. If you want to know more, just come over to the analyst lab anytime. Bunsekikantoa. Gaito 
analysts examine and review data analysts from street scanners, determines victims, cause of death, and many other things. We work, we work with her a lot. Keep that in mind. Ah, eto. Watashi wa kanshikan no tsunemori akane desu. Tsure de sotchi ga. I am Inspector Sun. I am Inspector Akari Sunemori, and this is. Anata to onaji shikoka no Kunizuka Yayoi. Yayoi Kunizuka, an enforcer, just like. Kara no mori jo ni tsunemori jo ni Kunizuka jo ne. いや、綺麗なお嬢さんたちと同じ職場ってのはテンション上がるね。Hey, hey, I know what you're doing, fam. You try to shoot your shot already. You not slick. <laughs> Miss Kadanomori, Miss Sunomori, and Miss Kunizuka. I see. Man, it puts me in really high spirits to get to work with such beautiful faces. バカなことは言ってないで。さっさと行くぞ。<laughs> Stop saying stupid things to get a move on. And sooner more, remember to return before lunch. Hi, Bakarimasta. Isogimasha, Karanomori san, Kunizuka san. Oh, yes, understood. Miss. I'm going to struggle her name this whole walk through, aren't I? Miss Karanomori, Miss Kunizuka, we should get going. <laughs> See you around, Tsurugi. I wonder how long it's been. 30 40 minutes from too far. This is the office of the CID's Division 1. We usually operate here. <laughs> hmm. So this place is. The office was less organized than I expected. I wondered if everyone here was an enforcer. They all seem to be doing as they please. They really made him introduce himself when no one's in this picture, but okay. My name's Takuma Sulugi, and I have been assigned to CID's Division 1 as of today. I look forward to working with you all. As I continued the bow, I noticed a middle-aged man who had the presence of a veteran detective stand up from a seat in the back. Ah, so you're the new enforcer. Well, as you can see, so long as there's no trouble, we hunting dogs have it pretty good. Just take it easy. Take it easy, you say. And you are. Oh, okay. So you're the new enforcer. Oh, okay. 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 Well, let's all get along as fellow enforcers. I noticed a stack of manga piled up above Kagari's desk. Could it be? Wow, is that a vintage shonen manga? Oh man, I remember this cover. It was one of my favorites. Excited, I picked it up. I always thought I'd only be able to find these in museums, but never thought I'd actually see a real paperback up close. Much less hold it. It? What is this? Could it be that you're someone who knows your stuff? Yeah, I cried when he fell to his death as he fought the enemy. Hmm?Takumasulugi, was it? We've got much to talk about. I particularly like the part where when all the rivals band together. 
わかるわかるお前とはかなり気がいそうだなシュウつうか紙媒体ってあたりわかってるな Yeah, just totally easier reading them online. <clears throat> well, I mean, in the US it's easier, but in Japan, nah, trying to find raw only manga in Japan was not online, it's not easy. But they got like a lot of bookstores and stuff that you can easily find manga, any manga that you want. It was really easy. Oh, I totally understand. I think I'm going to get along with you really well, Shu. You really know what's up if you read paperback manga. Miyuchi no eikyo de saikin hamatte te sa, kabi no manga. Sagasu no kuro shita n da ze. I got into paperback manga recently because of a friend of mine. It was tough to find though, man. Nanda, nanda. Tsurugi wa Kagari no dorui ka? What's that? Are you just like Kagari? Yeah, retoro tsu ka. Atsui mon ga suki na dake tsu ka. あとはタバコとかマージャンとか刑事のたしなみって感じで渋いじゃねえか。Yeah, I like retro stuff, or rather just cool stuff like smoking and mahjong. It just feels man, like part of detective's repertoire. お、とつさん、こいつはカモが来たぜ。<笑> Damn. Hey pops, we got ourselves a sucker here. お。打てるなら今夜早速囲むか新人の親睦会って名目でな If you can play then how about we have a game tonight then It'll be a welcome party for the new guy 喜んで参加させてもらうぜ Sounds like a plan I'd be happy to join 執行官同士親睦を深めるのは勝手だが仕事は真面目にやれ It's your own free will to have fun with your fellow enforcers But take your job seriously. Aye, hi. Demo, I'm a hero, yes, miss you. Got it, but isn't it lunch break? Oh, my, no, it's more so hurry to meet an idea. Tamania, you can look more still, does all. You need to stop always being so tense. A break is necessary every now and then. Mental therapy, you are taking the key of the day. No, go to the crowd at your doorstep. I have my regular mental therapy session to attend. By the way, where's Kukitachi? Nadeshko-chan nara o hanatsumi ni itta kara. Mou sugu kaette kuru to omoimousu. If you're looking for Nadeshiko, she went to water the flowers. I'll fi- I figure she'll be back soon. Hana o tsumi ni? Kimmu chuu dozo. Watering... flowers? It's work hours, you know? Toire no ingo shou. It's a euphemism for going to the restroom. Oh, <laughs> His face, though. His face. Uh, that's really misleading. She went to the restroom. Then just say she went to the restroom. Due to our roles, there's a gap between inspectors and enforcers. But Ginoza might actually be quite fun. Then again, it was still easier to be with the enforcers. <laughs> As I thought about such things, a woman entered the office. Tadaima Modorimasta. Sochira no Katawa. Sorry if you were looking for me. Who was that over there? Hundizuke the Heizok Tonata. Shikoka no Tsurugi Takumada. Tsurugi. Kanajo a Saikin Heizok Sereta. Kanshika no Kugatachi Nadeshko. Shinjin de Varuga. Whatever to Onajiku. Takuma Sulugi, a new enforcer who was assigned today. Sulugi, meet Narashigo Kukitachi. She's the newly assigned inspector as well as your superior. Kugatachi desu, Sulugi Shikoka. Enforcer Sulugi, I am Kukitachi. When I peered into this woman's cold eyes, I felt a certain tightness in my heart for some reason. My job is to utilize and monitor you. I see no need to get all friendly, 
but I expect the minimum level of cooperation and subordination from you that will be necessary for work. It, oh, oh. Uh, oh, okay. A stern voice and a rational speaking pattern totally different from her appearance. That presence of hers reminded me of you, Kelly. Surugi, Shikoka. Kikoite imasuka. Enforcer Surugi, did you hear me? Oh, 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 I'm Kikoite. But, just a little bit. I was a friend of mine. So, I was surprised. Ah, yeah. Sorry, I heard you. It's just that you really. Reminded me of an old friend, so I was a little surprised. No, she was carrying my singer. Another no, the Maya, what she was a kyoto, but she didn't send it. Another to what she got she's in there at the Kano Seva. Kagirina Kzeroni Chikaito Morimas. My sincere apologies, but I have never heard of your name until just now. As such, I believe the possibility that you and I were acquaintances is near zero. Curved. Yeah, I got through. Meet a mekara stays in Zenchigoshina. No, I understand. Plus, you look totally different from her anyway. Even then, her indifference and calculative reasoning reminded me strongly of Euclid, and I felt my chest ache. However, I didn't let this sentimentally overtake me. I had decided to find Euclid, and I wasn't about to let this woman I just met stop me. Thank you, Tanoze, Kungatachijo. Today, I and you will eat the same food as you will eat the same food. Looking forward to working with you, Miss Kukitachi. From now on, we're detectives until the very end. Wait for me, Hercule. I will definitely find you, no matter where where you may be. Coolio. The first mission came quickly. I had sunk further into the abyss. I hated what yearned to take me. The city that had taken her from me. How ironic that it took me in as a detective. But moreover, my first case wasn't in Tokyo. What is this? Sado Kaijushi. Ori no Kokyo. Masaka Kumura no Hayaku Modokku Kurita no Mori. I don't know who it's in, in my hometown. Who would have ever thought that I'd come back here so soon? So I don't know who it's in. We got the people. The 40 gold martini went between the mainland, Sado, and the Nodal Peninsula. Often referred to as the Metro Paradise. It once had a bright future as a mining dust for methane hydro, but now it's nothing more than a desolate mining town destined to perish. Widespread use of drones, the northern use of the unmanned ramp. Like that, as mining became automated, the people began leaving Sodom and Marine City. Now that sounds about right. People left as more jobless. Yeah? Yeah. Mm. The decline of population had already begun when I was a kid. Those in the suburbs left first, and as a result, the abandoned district grew. Yuki and I had grown up in this dying city as neighbors. We often looked out of our windows together, gazing at the streets that spread towards the city's growing center. However, I think we all knew that behind all the bright lights were the vast experience of ruins, which is always empty places. Return home in the first case, huh, Suruji? おかげで早速お役に立てるかもしれない。なんたって俺には土地勘があるからな。Strange turns of events, isn't it? However, thanks to that, I may already be of use since I'm pretty familiar with the city. その息だ。お前が鼻の利く病気ならきっとうまくやれる。That's the spirit. If you have a keen nose, you'll be fine. Right on. <laughs> the 
the incident had been caused by some dumb kid. With that being said, we couldn't just leave him be. It was a kidnapping after all. The missing person is Shiori Matsukata. Her parents claim she had not returned home since last night. The girl shown in the monitor was quite pretty, cute face and round, clear eyes. Age 16, seemed like she was attending a high school in Tokyo. <laughs> If she's not a latent criminal like us, maybe it's because she's just around that age when kids start fooling around, don't you think? Unlike you, Shiori Matsukata's psychopath is a clear color. However, there is something that seems suspicious. Suspicious? Take a look at this. The picture on the monitor changed. It went from a street camera and showed Shiori Matsukata smiling. Smiling at some kid, but only the back of his head was visible. It seemed like they were going into an automated taxi together. <coughs> Who's that kid? We don't know his identity yet. They seem to be on good terms. Just look at her face. What a nice smile. Does she look like she just met an old friend? I thought that too. I think the two are old friends. Maybe they knew each other from middle school. Why do you think so, Miss Sunomori? There is evidence to back it up. Miss Karanomori found it when analyzing the footage from the street cameras, but. <coughs> By analyzing and extracting footage from the street cameras and scanners, finding these high school students is going to be a breeze. <laughs> All we had to do was follow their tracks. Hey, yo, I guarantee you, this is not going to be a breeze. <laughs> oh. Thanks for coming today. I didn't expect you to come at such short notice, but I had a good time. Huh? Wait. Huh? Oh. Huh? What? Wait, aren't you still having a good time? I have to go. I have a curfew. Huh? Huh? What do you mean, curfew? Don't you live by yourself in Tokyo? My AI secretary keeps a log. My curfew is 7 p.m. Any later and my family will be notified. Pretty soon my mom will call me. Are they that stupid? Do they really have such little faith in their daughter? If so, they should have never let you move to Tokyo in the first place. Hey fam, is you trying to GTD? He might be on that. Hey, I'm in Tokyo for school. My parents are only thinking about my future. What about me? Are you just gonna leave me behind? Come with me, let's go to the same high school again. <laughs> and that's where shit went downhill. 
Suddenly, it seemed like Shiori's cell phone started ringing. <laughs> oh, oh, it's my mom. Sorry, but I really have to go. Hey, what what are you doing? The male suspect grabbed Shiori's cell and shoved his own cell on her face. The moment she saw it, her face froze. The hollow image projected from his phone was of Shiori in middle school uniform. She was asleep, hunched over on her desk, and her skirt all wrinkled. Um. Okay. Going a bit invasion of privacy and creepiness here, dude, but okay. When, when did you take this hollow? Hey, fam. You, you took a picture of her in HD, in high definition, while she was asleep. Sure. That's not creepy at all. Isn't it cute? That's you back when we were in the same class. I snapped it in 3D HD so it's crystal clear, no matter what angle you view it from. I'll send this to all your friends from your cell. Uh, uh, is he blackmailing her because he fell asleep in class? Or is that something completely different here? You know, I, I'm leaning on it must be something completely different by the way she is reacting. Stop! Delete it now! She already desperately lunged for her phone. The male suspect ran away, taunted her. Then they both vanished from the street camera's view. That was all the evidence we could retrieve. That uniform in a hollow. I feel like I've seen it before. Oh yeah? <laughs> What's this? Does Taku have a schoolgirl fetish? <laughs> it's not like that. Miss Tsunamori, that uniform in the holo image of Shiori Matsukata. What school is it from? It appears to be from a local middle school. Sado Kaijoshidana. Ingata no umino winyaru. Metan hydore to Kusakutoshida. Soda. Sado Marine City. So then, it must be in that methane hydrate mining sector in Niigata, right? Yoku shite masu ne. You're well in <coughs> You can tell that specific uniform is from a middle school in Niigata? What a maniac. No, that's not it. South Marine City is my hometown. Hometown. Now that is a piece of information missing from my memories. Without any of her memories, she probably felt a bit empty not knowing where her hometown was. But she didn't seem to spot it and question Miss Sunomori. So, is it possible the suspect attended the same middle school as Shiori Masukata in Santa Marine City? Isn't that correct, Inspector Sunomori? That is right. Were either of them seen after this footage was taken?
Her whereabouts are still unknown. The suspect hasn't been seen since. So you're saying he's on the move, yet avoiding the street cameras. At the very least, it seems the suspect is aware he is committing a crime. Tokyo Have you checked all the records of street cameras and scanners outside of Tokyo? Especially within, uh, within the Hokuriki region, as well as the other PSB data systems? So only Tokyo has this technology. Well then. We're searching, but don't be optimistic. Infrastructure beyond Tokyo is lacking, and moreover, the Hokuriki region is a granary. Unhin uninhabited places have less scams. Tongai? Hokuriki? Sorete? Masaka? Outside of Tokyo, Hokuriki region? Wait, are you? Juyo Sankoni no Shonen wa Matsukata Shiori ni Uttaite imashita. The suspect told Shiori Matsukata to come with them back to their hometown so they could be together again. Are you serious? Apparently, such things had happened a long ago. I once heard about it from Yukri after she read a classic novel she liked. I think it was called Elope. Niigatakeen A thorough investigation was conducted at once. All street scanners among underwater subway stations were analyzed and footage from the cameras were reviewed. Oh no. Shiori Matsukata's terrified face popped up in a pixelated 2D image as the male suspect forced Shiori onto the train. His face can now be clearly seen. Dark Oriju. It was easy to identify him now. Him now. Haruto Sato, age 16, born in Sato Marine City, where he currently attends a local high school. Haruto's hue was a dark orange color, quite cloudy. Thankfully, Shiori hue, Shiori's hue had not worsened that Sato much. Haruto no wa dark orange. That's surprising, because she's terrified the the, the hue color of Haruto Sato is dark orange. This color bears a risk of impulsive criminal tendencies and requires immediate therapy. Dominator的にはどうなんだ? <coughs> How would the dominator react? Is he a target of execution? それはドミネーターを向けてみるまでわかりません。潜在犯化している可能性でしたら低くはありませんが。We don't know that until we aim the dominator at him, though the possibility of him becoming a latent criminal is not likely. <laughs> Thought so. Good. We might make it in time. He might be spared the fate I had of being sent to an isolation ward and may still be able to return to society. <laughs> However, the fact is that his crew had deteriorated. We, the PSB CID position in Western City, Sado Marine City, my hometown. <laughs> Hey, how long are you planning to drag me around for? Are we going to sleep outdoors again tonight? I want to shower. So, 
たまには野宿もいいもんだよな見ろよお前の寝顔可愛く撮れてる Don't look so scared. Sleeping outdoors every once in a while is fine, okay? Take a look at your own well rested face. It turned out quite well. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm going to get a little bit of 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 Another picture? What's wrong with you? The hollow image you showed me yesterday was taken in the classroom, right? Do you get off on taking peep and tom photos or what? Don't that's all. Oh my god. I'm not a cow you got off. Oh, you don't consider it's more than a cup. Well, that's because you're too cute. I never plan on misusing it though. So creepy. Haruto no yatteru koto te kyouhaku da yo. Liar, what you're doing is blackmail. Ko de mo shinakira. Tsuite kite kure nakatta janai ka. Hanareta kunai nda. Mada suki nanda. Tanana, mo ni dota awanai da nate yuwanai de kure. If I did it, you wouldn't have come along. I don't want to be separated from you anymore. I still like you. So please stop saying things like we'll never meet again. I never said anything like that. You did. I have proof. Look at this text. Here's what it said. Once I get to Tokyo, it's the end. It won't do either of us any good. We'll never meet again. Stay well. What's this? That wasn't me. It must have been my mom. She had it to my account and sent it. Your mom? Mama was saying that. Tokyo to go to Tokyo, you want to make a lot of good friends for the future. Oh, she told me I needed to make a lot of good friends to be useful for my future when I went on to study in Tokyo. What are you doing? I'm not going to kill you for the future of the future. I'm not going to kill you for the future of the future. What's up with that? Am I just some classmate from the sticks who wouldn't be useful for your future? Is that why she made you sever ties with me? I don't think that's what I thought. That's why Haruto asked me to ask me to ask you. We were just playing together. I never thought of it that way. That's why when you popped up out of the blue, I was happy to see you and hung out with you still. So that's right. If you're not afraid of me, you won't be able to meet me. I just wanted to meet you and meet you again. I just wanted to meet you again. Well, that... That's true. If you hated me, you wouldn't have met up with me anyway. <laughs> I guess I was right to come visit you. But I'd expect you to know my address. Your AI secretary must be really advanced in order to locate my address all the way in Tokyo. <laughs> 昨日も話したけどさ朝起きたらホロアバターがいきなり名乗ってさいつの間にか新しい AI がダウンロードされてたんだろうけど Isn't it? I already told you this yesterday, but when I woke up one morning 
There was this new Holo avatar who introduced itself. I wonder when it got downloaded though. This is what the AI told me. I am Alpha. I'm here to help you. There's someone you want to see, isn't there? No need to hide it from me. I've been watching you. Why don't you go find her? It's not like you can't go to Tokyo, right? If you need someone to guide you, I can do that for you. So it is And before I knew it, the AI led me to you. It was like fate, right? You and I never should be separated from each other. So Maybe. Well, are you satisfied now? Give me my phone. I ended up skipping class and I need to call my mom back. It's all good, right? Hey, why don't you just stay a little longer? Like a date. I didn't even do anything to you last night, right? Well, I guess I'll stay with you, but only for today. And promise me this delete that hollow image, return my cell phone, and never do anything like this again, okay? Sure. Now, where should we go? There's lots of places in this town filled with memories, huh? Alright, I've been courting for about 50 something minutes. Yeah, it's been yeah, it's been a long time, so I'm going to stop here. It's definitely starting to pick up. It really is. I'm <laughs> it's really starting to pick up. I'm having fun playing this, you guys. But once again, please leave a like in the comment section, comment section below. If you played this game before, uh don't spoil it for the other people that have not played it. Specifically don't spoil it for me. <laughs> but if you spoil it, uh please give me any tips or anything I should know about. Um, but that's it for today, guys. Have a great day, everybody. Goodbye.